Hello everyone, welcome back to another FSD beta video. We finally got 11.4.4 right now, so we're going to take it out for a drive. I'm going to do a few waypoints here nearby my neighborhood, so it's, um, yeah, I'm not going to really go to downtown yet, but uh, hopefully tomorrow I'll have enough time to do that, so stay tuned for more videos, and uh, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for getting notified whenever a video drops. So here we go. Um... FSD is engaged right now, so we're we're on a 40 kilometer speed zone limit over here in this area. Let's see how it takes us out of here. So we're coming up to a stop sign. It does see it, and it's represented on the visual. Let's come to a stop. Should be able to head out now. Or it's, it's highlighting the blue car in front of us, so let's go into... Yeah, here we go. The person was giving us the indicator to go ahead and he was uh, letting me go ahead so I just tapped the accelerator there just to give it a nudge so yeah in these situations um, you know he's he has the right of way to be honest so he should be able to go ahead but um, and our car was waiting for that uh, opportunity but uh, he decided to give us the right of way it should slow down for this car coming up here on the left hand side and now we should be able to proceed Ooh, a little bit of a break there for that pedestrian right across the street on the sidewalk uh, not necessary that was not required let's see if it sees us Ooh, and I tapped the accelerator there by mistake I apologize for that uh, I was going for the uh, accelerator pedal but I tapped the brake pedal actually And yeah, I had to decrease the speed limit, so that's an intervention because of the um, 30 kilometer playground school, uh, school zone, actually. Yeah. So the usual. There's a lot of school zones over here in this area, so... Um, and it doesn't really do a good job of, uh, of picking them out. Let's see if it does for this one. It's right out there in the middle of the... Uh, it's very, very visible doesn't come up over here but let's see if it does come up over here no it doesn't that's very odd I wonder if these um, speed zones are actually uh, a map layer and it does stop for that pedestrian so awesome job for that it's saying that it's creeping forward for visibility highlights the bus so it does see it as well it should be clear to go right now and it does go around the bus. Ooh, folds the mirror for this. Come on, FSD. This is a piece of cake. It's doing it, but it's a little bit timid, so still needs a little bit more flushing out for these type of maneuvers. Coming up to our left over here. This is a free flow, so we shouldn't really be stopping. It's just a little bit hesitant. Yeah, we're back at 50 right now. worthwhile noting that these roads are actually they have no lane markings at all as well they're quite wide roads so but it's still it's driving in a in a great position as well the positioning on the road is good and it's not trying to overtake cars in front of us so happy with that i guess uh so we have a left coming up here now i don't really need to go there so i'm just going to head up over here and then i'll put in another Another waypoint, and I'll be back. All right, so we've got a, another waypoint in. Let's see how it does. Yeah, it's quite clear. There's a car coming in very fast on my on my right hand side, but it's it's okay. We're gonna come up to a stop here. for visibility now it's very clear on the left so we should just gun this out here we go Ooh, harsh break over here okay it's a green light i'm hoping for smooth entry into the intersection very nice let's look promising so we were going through this before and we had the 
a slight break while entering the intersection, which I really hate those because uh, you're prone to getting rear-ended for those. Okay, changing lanes over here as the construction ends. And coming into this right turn. Nicely done. It should be a little bit more faster here for this. It should be able to go, just go. Okay. A little bit slow, a little bit slow for those yields. I have to say, even though it's slow, it does give you the confidence that it's uh, thoroughly checking for traffic or, or cross traffic. But at the same time, the, peop the, the person right behind you or the car right behind you is going to be waiting on you for such a long time for a s simple task like that. So it's not very convenient uh, to have FSD engaged in those situations. It's green right now, so we should be able to go, but it's just being cautious for that car. Yeah, it should be a little bit more aggressive. It's the green light, and you can't just go and stop, go and stop like that. You're also, um, yeah, you're prone to getting rear-ended again. Same story. But hey, it did it by itself. Okay, should be choosing this right lane over here just getting ready for a right turn coming up okay no signaling to turn into this right turning lane and we have a yield sign we should really stop for this pedestrian I'm going to interfere over here normally FSD is pretty good in these situations so I'm gonna engage again not stopping for pedestrian crossing All right, that was a decent yield after I uh, interjected there for that uh, pedestrian to cross. Okay, I'm coming up to another right turn. Let's see how this yield goes, it goes through as well. Quite the slowdown, does the check. Should be able to proceed over here. Ooh, and a break. Wonder why it does that. Like, you're in the middle of the road. You shouldn't really be braking over there. Okay, so we are here at the park. So I'll put in another destination after we do the stop over here. And there is, I think there is a pedestrian that's going to cross on our left-hand side. And is, are they going to highlight the person? Yes, they do. So it's going to wait. There we go. Nice. Even though the person's on a scooter, it's still, uh, it's still um, highlighted that. And we should be able to proceed over here. Now it does say navigation complete, so it might be interfering with that. I'm gonna give it a tap over here. Yeah, I'm gonna disengage. It's just cause the, the, um, it's just cause the, um, the waypoint is right here. I think that's why there's a little bit of interference. Put in our next destination and we'll, uh, we'll check it out. Okay, let's go. Here we go. Went out of that parking lot uh, properly. So it's another 30 kilometer speed zone. Let's see if it detects this. No, it doesn't. Incorrect speed detection. Okay, another 30 kilometer speed zone. Let's see if it detects this. Nope, and we have someone that's crossing as well. Did not detect 30 kilometer speed zone. There's the voice note. Come on, do it. Oh, come on, just do it. Hi, yay, yay. Oof, why, why? And what's with this trajectory? It really wants to make the right, so it's kind of like, uh, oh boy. Anyway, yeah, let's see how it does this one, I guess. Stopping for traffic. I mean, the, the planner is really interjecting a lot with, uh, with the way it drives. Um, even though it needs to do the right, it shouldn't, it shouldn't mean that it has to pick the right lane and uh, right at the turn. 
Um, I really wish they they don't really do these forceful overrides from the planner in those situations. Just in order to have a smooth drive. Now it's going to have to wait for those cars to pass in front of us because this is an unprotected left. And it does a great job. It creeps in forward, but gotta, gotta go faster, gotta go faster. This is way too slow. The car behind me is already up on my back. Or my, or my rear. Coming up to this uh, unprotected green traffic light over here for the left hand side. This area is pretty dense with uh, pedestrian. Okay, we've got the protected green light now for turning left. No hesitation, very smooth. Okay, very good. Very happy about that. Should take a right instantly over here. Great. Nicely done just to catch up here before traffic uh, backs up and we can get into the right hand side. Okay, let's see where we at. I might cross this bridge just coming up over here and then I'll probably change my destination again. I really like this. Check this out. It really sticks to the right lane just to just to make this this right right turning lane over here and not to miss it. Very good job. Just mimicking the same behavior of a normal driver. Excellent. This is a yield. Let's see how fast it is on this yield. Pretty good, pretty good. Nice, nice engagement and very quick. Changing lanes over here. Awesome, just to catch the lane that takes us straight across to the other side. And a very, very slow down over here. I'm gonna have to tap over here, the accelerator. It's slowing down because the traffic light is occluded by the, by the vision of, uh, the vision of the traffic light is occluded due to the bus. Okay, I'm sticking to the same lane over here, not changing lanes. We've got the green light, we should be able to go ahead. Awesome. That was a smooth interaction, very happy with that. Okay, so this kind of this kind of sets us up uh, nicely for 4.4. Uh, we'll probably do more testing. Um, I'll probably do downtown, and then I'll probably do roundabouts again. Uh, and yeah, uh, please stay tuned and please hit like for my video. Really appreciate that and uh, Please subscribe as well and stay tuned for the next few videos that are gonna come out I uh, hope you folks like this first impressions video and we'll see you folks on the next one. Have a nice day